Every gardener has their challenges. In Chicago, we're faced with the extremes, and my exposed apartment balcony certainly sees its share of wind, snow, and cold. But for every miserable day, there will always be a glorious one. I'm excited to share the developments of my Japanese-inspired balcony garden this spring. I love growing Japanese maples. I love their graceful forms and striking leaves that come in a multitude of shapes and colors. Despite their delicate appearance, they're actually quite easy to grow. There's only a few things that Japanese maples hate, and that is wind, full sun, and extreme cold, all of which unfortunately characterize my apartment balcony. However, for every garden challenge, there's usually many solutions, and I'd like to share with you how I keep and care for my garden plants. In the winter, we use our front west-facing balcony as a cold frame. Once the plants go into dormancy, they get huddled together in their winter home for a four to five month hibernation. Although many plants, including Japanese maples, do require a cold period to store up energy for the next season, overwintering outdoor container plants in a cold frame allows you to avoid severe low temperatures and ensures they won't be exposed to an unexpected thaw and freeze cycle that can easily kill even established trees planted in soil in the unpredictable spring weather. Ideally, while still in dormancy is a good time to give your trees their haircut. Getting rid of any crossing or dead branches and aesthetically pruning it enhances each tree's character and beauty. In early April, we finished laying out the structure of the garden. The wooden tiles and reed fencing softens the original plain metal structures. They not only set the tone and the mood of the garden, but also act as an important wind and sunscreen for the plants. Once the foundation was set, it was just a matter of placing the plants in their optimal positions. Here we have chosen only plants that have been proven to be wind and sun tolerant, such as river birch, Chicago hardy bamboo, conifers, irises, hostas, and grasses. Placing larger plants over the more delicate smaller ones further help to ensure the garden stays intact through whatever mother nature throws our way. Although I yearn to have a more traditional garden someday with a fenced in yard and earth to plant in, for now, I'm loving my balcony garden because I still get to experience my trees and plants come back year after year. I hope this might inspire other apartment dwellers to grow something you love, even if the odds are against you. As they say, if there's a will, there's a way.